So the goal of this video is to learn how to use the table feature of our graphing calculator in order to perform limit analysis. So my function that I'm going to use as an example is the function 1 over x. And we're going to take the limit of this as x approaches infinity. So first I'll enter my function y1. And then I'll go second window to go to my table set. And I'm going to select ask for my independent variable. This will give me control over the values I plug in as my inputs, as my x values. Then I'll hit second and graph to go to my table. And here I will plug in larger numbers of x, since we are approaching positive infinity in this case. So as x gets bigger and bigger, then I'm going to be analyzing what the height value, what the y value of this function is doing as x gets bigger. So as you can see from our values, as x gets bigger, our y values are getting smaller and smaller, approaching 0. Not only could I answer that question numerically, but I could look at it from a graphical standpoint as well. So I go to my window key. And then I fix my window values, my domain and range, such that I can see a good view of x as it gets larger and larger. Then I hit the graph button, and as you can see from the graph, as x gets bigger, y gets smaller. Approaching a value of 0.